morning, everyone. It is June right now. It's the end of June. Today is the 26th. But I'm going to get a little jump start on my first project pan of my life for July. I love Charlie Brown. I love peanuts. I'm going to get my first start. Uh, I'm going to get a jump start. And let me give you a quick little tour of my recording space. First of all, we have my exercise stuff my bands and my rules for my boys and their friends. I have some drawers here that are full of miscellaneous. Um, this one's got makeup and skincare in it that I haven't had a chance to try yet. This is a bunch of bags just to line my trash. Feminine products in here. We've got a bunch of receipts in there. This is my fairy garden. It's not really pertaining to anything right now. But some more skincare in here. Some thank you notes planner stuff, things that need attention, and one of the cat's favorite places to be, their little tree. Pumpkin sleeps in here sometimes, but lately they mostly just are territorial about this top section. And then you see my keyboard. We love wolves in our family. There's a little CD player. It's a stray receipt down there. And then you have <clears throat> some stuff here. This is where I'm going to put my project pen items that do fit. And this is what I'm going to be choosing from. I have a few things already chosen. I have some other stuff over here. This needs to be organized, so I'll be working on that. So over here, I need to choose from the eyeshadow palettes. And... See my earrings there? I've made most of those. Got some beauty related stuff that I keep stocked. I've got some chocolate that I try to keep stocked. I'm working on some empties over here in this corner. Let me show you my quick little recording setup. So, here, this is just to catch any powder, dust, shimmer, or foundation. And here is a a little octopus holder, like a tripod. I can just clip this on the mirror. It's foam, so it's not going to scratch my mirror, and this is where I can hold my phone if I record with my phone. There's my ring light. There's This is not plugged in. That's one of my lights, and I need my umbrellas. So I can sit here at this chair, and my little garbage right over there, and my cords that need to be kind of cleaned up. So let's get into this project pan. I know that I'm going to want to use these up, uh, first of all, because I really, uh, I think these are on the way out anyway. This Wander Beauty Unlashed is almost dried up, so I think that's going to be what I use on the bottom lashes. And if I, if I use it up, I will, I'm going to have to grab another one because this is sometimes too thick for what I want. So I'll use the It Superhero, and then I have a Mary Kay one that's not up here. I believe it's in my purse, so I'll put my Mary Kay one in there because I think that one's on its way out also. This is a Mary Kay lip liner. It's pretty nude. Um, it's called Soft Blush. So I'll use that a few times, and it'll probably be gone soon. There's a Milani Stay Put Waterproof. That's good for summer. Here's a Physician's Formula Gel Lacquer in Ultra Black. I'm not sure I like it, so I'm going to try it. And if I hate it, I'm going to get rid of it. I <laughs> hope I don't hate it because I love Physician's Formula for the most part. I've got a, slim, uh, a Shady Slim pencil that is too warm and too blonde for me. But I will mix in some brown. I have another brown that's lighter than this, so I'm going to do a little bit of mixing. I have three setting sprays to choose from. And I like this one at night before I go to bed. So I think I'm going to use this Glow Mist, Rose Glow Mist by Pixie. It's a little less than halfway full, I guess. Huh. Maybe by the time I shake it up, maybe uh, between a third and half full. So this can go back in here. And this one can go back in here. And then, okay, so for foundation, I know this one's on its way out. It's almost dried up. It's the Physician's Formula Cushion Foundation with SPF 50. I noticed that I have to dip in quite a few times with my brush to cover my face, but it's a really quick, easy coverage. I love it. I got it on clearance at CVS, and it doesn't expire until uh, October of next year. 
but I do know that it's on its way out. There's, it's hard to get product out. I have this little sample and I'm not sure I like this very well. It is matte and I like a luminous foundation, but I'm going to try to use this up. It's a little bit too dark for me, but I'll see if I can make it work. And then I have this one I need to work on. There's, I love these office clips. I use them all the time. Um, for toothpaste, for eye products. Let me show you a couple others. They're on this eye product here. Some other stuff. Um, I just keep them around. I've got one there and one here ready to use. So this is a beauty balm. It's got SPF 30 in it. And I just want to make a dent because I have some new ones. And I've had this long enough, I'd like to use it up. So that's three foundation options. Then I need a powder. And I'm not sure I like this one a whole lot. This is Fair Conceal and Perfect Shine Proof Powder. I like shine. I don't mind it. But I'm going to see if I like it. So I'll try to use that. And if I don't feel like using that, I will use the Prep Set and Glow by Milani in number two. And then I need some highlighters. I don't have a lot of highlighters. Highlighters and blushes and contour bronzers I'm lacking a lot, as, along with setting sprays and um, eyeliners and brow products. I think I'm lacking quite a bit in that department. So do I want white or do I want pink? I think I'll use this pink one. This is in Pink Rose, the butter highlighter. And here is a small, a mini milk makeup and this is called the holographic stick we're not gonna be able to read that but it says supernova so that will be it. and then okay a blush I need a blush let's use this honest beauty um, cream cheek color cheek blush and it's in peony pink it's good for summer and then I have not tried this I've not tried this yet this will be good for summer this came in boxy charm so that will be my blush options, my highlighter options, I've got powder, I've got foundation, I've got two mascaras plus the one that's in my purse, I've got brow products, liners, and most of the time I line with eyeshadow anyway with a really flat, narrow brush. Stay there. And then let's get some concealer. I want this Ulta Beauty Youthful Glow Concealer Medium Coverage. I got this for about four dollars. It was two for four dollars, or four dollars each, or two for nine, or something during their 21 Days of Beauty. And then this is NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop. I don't even know if I like this. I've used it once or twice, so I'm going to give this a whirl. Let's get into the glosses. I have a peach colored with glows with gold flex, Fancy Nancy by Mary Mary Kay. And these glosses are beautiful, but they're rather sticky and gummy, so I'm going to give this a chance, and if I just find that it's a really big problem for me, I will say goodbye to it at the end of the month, at the end of July. This is a really nice nude. It's also from... Ah, come on. It doesn't want to focus for us. It's also by Mary Kay. It is... Ah, come on. There we go. No, there we don't go. Okay, Jelly Lip Gloss. This is Teddy Bear, and then I want this Milani Lip Plumper. Nope, this is not Milani. This is Revlon. I'm going to try the Milani one soon. This is in Rosy Future, recommended by Emily Noel. Then I need some lipsticks, and again, I'm going to go for Mary Kay because I need to use up Mary Kay or say goodbye to it. So here's a really nice summery red. You won't be able to tell right now, but I will show you next week in my update video in Sunset. And then this one is called Shell, and it's discontinued, so I want to use this one up. Is Oh, I need a primer. Hello. Mineral Fusion Hydrating Primer. Um, I think I want to use this even though it is summer and my skin could tend to get more oily or whatever. I still want to use this because I don't love it a lot and sometimes it does a tiny bit irritate my cheeks so I but I do like it after a minute it goes away so I want to use this up because I'm not really a huge fan of it and I'm not going to repurchase it when it's out and then I like this touch and soul nor poor no problem that came in boxy charm so there's two options there I don't have a bronzer in front of me do I where's my Milani bronzer 
I have no idea where my Milani bronzer is, but that's the one I want to use. Maybe since it's summer. Oh, it's right in front of me. Okay, I need a cool tone bronzer. So that will be this sunlight and silky matte. And then I need the butter bronzer. This is in light bronzer. So this one's warmer. Does that look like it? I'll allow myself to pull in other things. Um, if, if I need to replace anything, I'll allow myself to use various of these because some of them are brand new to me, like my Luminoso. I've never opened this. And I've never opened this Burt's Bees, etc. So I've got quite a few nice things that I'd like to try. I just got these in the mail. Um, I have some BoxyCharm items I haven't even used yet. So that's going to wrap it up for today. And stay tuned. Next week I'm going to be doing a chatty get ready with me using these products. Um, obviously I won't use all of them. But I'm going to make a prediction right now on which ones I'll be able to actually throw away at the end of July. So I'm going to say hopefully we'll get close on that one. All of these brow and liners. Um, this mascara for sure. That foundation, that foundation. And maybe this setting spray. So out of everything that's left up here, this is what I get to play with. And we'll still have some left. This one will... We'll probably get pretty low because it's already kind of like to here. Um, so that's a that's a maybe. Maybe might get used up. And then the ones that I have my eye on that are kind of like on probation is the Mary Kay products and the NYX and this Milani powder. I know that I like everything else. So except for this, I haven't tried. But these here are on probation. And let's see, let's put that one in there because it is kind of gummy and I don't like my hair getting stuck in it. So that's why the Mary Kay glosses are on probation. So thank you again and I will see you guys really soon. Take care. Bye.